Hello, welcome to my tutorial. Uh, we're going to be applying makeup with a fidget spinner. Um, so let's go ahead and get this beautiful hair out of the. How do you. Um, um, well, maybe, maybe like. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay. okay. There we go. There we go. Okay, so now that I have my face, we can go ahead, um, I guess, pressed powder. Here we go. I don't even, do we just, is that, does that work? Is that what you do? You just kind of brush it on? Yeah, I guess it is, so. Gonna really, really goop that on there. I'll drop some. Okay, what is this, what is this? What does this go on? Press power, I guess, your face, I guess, okay. This isn't working. Fidget spinner's not gonna work for that. So we'll just have to apply this one the other way. Okay, so we'll just, I guess, we'll just grab a little bit and just kind of. Here, can we actually, there we go. This is, this is much better. So we've already got some on the cheeks here. We just kind of, all right, so we just, I think this looks nice and natural. <laughs> this is, now that we have a base down, let's see, this is, oh, we have a liquid make. Oh. Let's go ahead and get this out here. Liquid makeup. What does this look like? Oh, it looks pretty natural. Yeah, that looks, that looks good. Okay. <laughs> so what you want to do is this is kind of going to use as a stick. I'm going to just kind of go ahead and then... Beautiful. Now we're going to go ahead and get some eyeliner on here. Oh, this one's blue. Okay, so we don't want to use too much on the blue here. So let's just kind of... Smoky look. We'll, we'll just... We'll just... This is... There we go. This is this is the eyeliner. So I'm just I'm just outlining outlining the eyeballs here. All right. What is contact makeup? I don't know what the, this liquid makeup is all over my face. I don't even know what this is for. I'm a little dizzy. <laughs> a little dizzy. I'm smashing my head. I'm a little dizzy. Okay. Here we go. Nice. Oh, perfect, perfect. So that's, that's that's all I wanted. That's all I wanted. Next up, we're gonna add a little bit of color. Now, color obviously doesn't look as natural as this, but it really does help out. Uh, you know, the overall aesthetics of everything. Because, you know, sometimes you want to just make sure you look good. I mean, for the most natural look, we can just actually, we can just go ahead. Because we all know how to apply this. I mean, there's no other way to do it. We'll just kind of go ahead and put this in here. We have the natural and the purple. And just, there we go. That's all we need to do. The beauty is with us now. All right, there we go. We are looking great. Oh yeah, just like this. Just remember, just do as I do. You know, this isn't really a tutorial, but if you want this kind of look, you're you're welcome to get it. Time for the mascara. So, when it comes to mascara, conventionally, mascara is just put on your eyelashes, whatever. It's nice and good. However, there's this new technique I've been working with here to put on mascara. And the way that it works actually is, so first off, 
You get your little mascara brush. Make sure there's some mascara on it. I just need to figure out how to do it. All right, that didn't work. So I guess we're gonna have to do this the hard way. We'll just go ahead, cause I wanna like close my eyes. So we'll just go ahead and really, really raise those lashes. Now we're gonna go ahead and put on our fake lashes we have here. Cleaning. So we have uh, wet and wild. I don't really know how they apply. Looks like they already have some sticky stuff on them, so we'll just go ahead and then just kind of. Okay, got it. Let me just kind of. Let me just. Got it. All right. Now we have some lip gloss here and some lip balm. All right, so now we have our lip balm here, so we have it kind of out all the way. We'll just kind of just. <laughs> Just like brushing. <laughs> so now that we have the lipstick applied here, we'll just kind of get rid of that. All right, now we have our lip gloss. You know, it's that nice kind of afterglow for for anything lip related. So we'll just, you really don't want to overdo it when it comes to lip gloss. Just a little bit on here. Got it. Now that, if you're if you're following this, if you're doing this as well, this is, this is, this is where normally you'd be done, you know? I personally, I like to sparkle a little bit. You know, sometimes you, that little sparkle will stand out, catches the light the right way, guy looks over, like, oh baby, you look nice. And I'm like, oh yeah. So that's really just a little bit of sparkle is really all you need, so. This is all we need, just get some sparkle on your hand here, as so, and then just, got it. 